Hi, I'm bringing you on a special trip away from the farm today to our local Amish store. It's hard for me to say with my lisp. So this is uh, one of our local Amish grocery stores and they have all kinds of neat baking supplies and just some really neat little items that their community supplies for their community. So come along with me and let's go buy some stuff for baking and see what else they have that's super cool and fun. I'm home from the country market. Say hi to the peeps, Gretel. And I have our bag here. And as soon as I take off my coat and wash my hands, um, I'm gonna show you what we got. Okay, be right back. Okay. Pull up a chair, why don't ya? Okay. So wasn't that fun? The country market. Country with a K. All those shelves of all those interesting items and different products that you just don't see normally. I specifically went there to try to get some baking um, accoutrement for my Valentine's Day cookies and my daughter, my granddaughter's birthday cake. So um, I wanted to show you what we ended up getting there. So my receipt from the old, with an E, old D, country, with the K, market. There's my receipt, and I spent $35.67. Okay, so here's what I got. Like a genie box. I got pretzel rods. I think those were $1.29. Let's see. Yep, $1.29. Okay, I'm gonna show you the stuff I got for next weekend when my son and his girlfriend come to visit. Um, they like to eat a lot of vegetables and, and um, just a little less meat and things like that. So, um, so I like to have different interesting food items on hand for, for them and us, I like to try new things. So it just, it's really nice because it just kind of pushes me along to like try some different new things without just slapping a big old steak on the plate. Okay. Mediterranean wild rice. Med Mediterranean wild rice. That looks yummy. It's got lentils in it. Oh my god, the list of ingredients is about 200 ingredients long. Okay, they have tons of bulk foods at the Amish stores, which I love. I love bulk foods because you're not paying for a ton of packaging and marketing. No offense, you marketing people, you're great, but you know, I'm just a little old country girl, so I don't have enough money to pay for fancy logos and stuff. Okay, anyway, um, brown and wild rice blend. Just like that. And then it's nice because they put recipes on the back. So, just in case you don't know how to make rice. <laughs> Water, rice, 
turn on the burner, cook, you're done. All right, I know, I know, it's more complicated than that. All right, so what else do we get? Okay. Stuffed pepper soup started. <laughs> Sounds good, doesn't it, Steele? Steele's getting all jealous. All right. Stuffed pepper, come on, focus. Stuffed pepper soup starter. That was a little expensive, five twenty-seven, but I thought it was interesting. Oh, here's the, here's the. So, and it's got a recipe on it too. I find that extremely helpful. Okay, I mean, even though I know how to cook and stuff, and I do it for a living, it's still nice to get. Try somebody else's recipes for change. I get so sick of my own cooking. Good lord. Okay, so now. White sanding sugar, three dollars. Red sanding sugar, two seventy six. Okay. okay, I'm gonna leave it the favorite though. There's some good ones in there. Okay. Red nonpareils. Those are so cute. I think I'm gonna put those on my daughter's birthday cake. On my granddaughter's birthday cake. Um, plain old red sprinkles. Can use those any time of the year. Okay. Oh, let's see. There's actually two in here. Let's see. Right, this is the boring stuff. Oh shoot! I should. I thought I was gonna get. I meant to get white vanilla flavoring. Oh well. And then we have rouge fraise. It's strawberry, but it's red food coloring. Yeah, liquid food coloring. Okay. For my frosting. And then my favorite things. Jumbo hearts. Are those so stinking cute or what? 324. Isn't that adorable? Those are so cute. And then also my absolute favorite, heart-shaped sprinkles. I think those are adorable. And when you put them with these and you put them on sugar cookies, I'm hoping to do a rolled sugar cookie video in the next week, just so people can do rolled sugar cookies for Valentine's Day if they want to. Um, Rolled sugar cookies are among the easiest thing in the world. There is one secret, and I'm gonna show you what it is. But anyway, thank you so much for coming along with me to the old the country with a K market Amish store. I can say that now without my lips. My lips but sometimes make me stumble. <laughs> you gotta laugh at yourself sometimes. Anyway, thank you for coming along and thank you for visiting me at Old Tavern Farm and I will see you again soon. Big hugs, hug, 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 bye.